welcome you all to the same national conference on transforming pharmacy as per the national education policy from holistic development organized by the department of pharmaceutical technology brainway university in collaboration with association of pharmaceutical teachers of india west bengal state branch all the esteemed guests all the participants colleagues and students a very good afternoon to all of you it is not only the numbers that are important whether we are able to teach our students well whether we are able to offer our students good jobs in this inaugural function of this national conference we have very dynamic and visionary leader the honorable chancellor mr palguni mukhopadhyay ratne in film making singing many examples are there sri palguni mukhopadhyay the chancellor of the brainware university because he is one of the key person who have established congratulations to all of you uh, for the successful lunar mission chandrayaan 3 saying the role of pharmacists is changing globally in terms of the public health care system and how do you think that implementation of nep 2020 is going to impact this factor when the public health will be very good benefited in india basically in developing countries and secondary for the industry you know that after coming of artificial intelligence and with the uh, development of the technology there are so many diversified fields are embedded with the pharmaceutical sciences like uh, biostatistics like artificial intelligence like cdm like pharma surveillance like lot many others coding medical coding and all those things and in future lot of other things are also going to come So we know NEP 2020 um, adds value on the integration of technology in education. So when it comes to pharmacy education, how do you think that technology can be leveraged in uh, enhancing the learning experience or practical training of the students? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it will be leveraged the, by using the uh, technology simulations, practicals. And uh, experiential learning is only useful and uh, it can be, uh, we can Uh, integrated with the technology and it will be improved for the pharmacies. It will be definitely useful for work. We know that India is the largest producer of generic medicines as well as vaccines. So today in this age of digitalization, how do you think that integration of artificial intelligence is going to boost the pharmaceutical produce of our country. Actually, we are having one of the largest system of higher education in our country. And uh, since we have to align with the need of the industries also to serve large number of people, not only for India but also for the world, therefore to facilitate this artificial intelligence will be one of the important aspect to come into the picture and also to enter in our education delivery system welcome you all for the second day of national conference organized by department of pharmaceutical technology brainware university in collaboration with Association of Pharmaceutical Teachers of India with Swingwell State Branch. <laughs>